data. Click import. Select import source. Select our USB. And then select our shape file. Hit select at the bottom. Expand our shape file. Find the field that you're going to be seeding. In this case, we're going to be in NB2. Hit import selected. Select prescription. Select your grower. Select your farm north of BIA Road. Select your field, NB2. If your field isn't on this list, you can add a new one. Same with the farm. Same with the farm and type it in. I'll show you the farm, add new. You can just add in a new farm. But we'll select our field. We already have NB2 NB2 in here, so we'll select that. We'll scroll down. Product form will be granular slash other. I like to change the default rate to 71, just so you know if your default rating, you see that 71. Hit done. And then this is important, this next box, make sure you select pounds per acre. Hit import, and on this side of the screen, it'll show you importing the file. Might take just a little bit, depending on field size. And you'll do this for every field once you get to it. You'll do this process for every field once you pull into the field and get ready to seed. I don't know if you've seen, but right away how we got to this uh, page in the first place is that that's the uh, upload right there. That uh, one with the arrow up, so that's how you import. The last field did not take this long, but oh, there we go. Import complete. So then you can go to the farm icon up here. Select your grower farm and field. So we're going to select north of BIA Road. Give it a second sometimes. We want NB2. Task is seeding 2023 and MBD2. Crop type is spring wheat. Scroll down past your tractor information. Select your controller, which is your tank that you're going to be variable rating from. In this case, we'll be variable rating out of meter one. Then you got your product, your mes, your prescription. Right now it says none, so this is important. Go ahead, hit the drop down, and then click this one. Your, it'll be your field name and your product. You can change your out of zone rate, but prescription default works pretty well. You can also change it to target rate one, which if you leave the field boundary will start applying 70 pounds.
hit the gear icon. If these don't match up, you'll hit match RX. This one does. So you're good to go. We can then go to run screen two in this case. Or run screen three, sorry. We can hit this uh, these three squares stacked on top of each other. We'll select the meter that our prescription is tied to, in this case, meter one, area, application rate. We'll hit the blue triangle. We'll change background from none. We'll turn that on. We'll select RX. We'll select our RX. We'll hit apply. And then we'll hit apply one more time and then our prescription map will show up, ensuring that our prescription is in the display.